that's easy to squeeze like a monkey. I've always been interested in science, and this is really enforcing it. My favorite subject in science is the human body, and I love seeing how it works and how your mind controls everything of part of your body. We have a community outreach event going on for students, elementary school students, in grades 4, 5, and 6. And what we're hoping to do is create an interactive and a fun environment for these students to gain an understanding and a passion for neuroscience and it's organized and run by the Human Kinetics Neuromuscular Physiology class. So all the stations, the day, the logo, the name, everything was developed by students within this particular class. Today is just about community involvement. We're trying to get young kids to come in, you know. We're trying to teach them about neuromuscular physiology. You know, really get them excited about what they're going to do in the future. We want to get these kids involved early and get them into sciences, right? And that's what we're trying to project here for them. I think that's probably for me the greatest reward is to see the interaction and the excitement both from the university students figuring out how to convey what they know at a really complex level to someone else that doesn't have a university education yet and that's elementary school kids. So by conveying knowledge to the broad population, they're gaining skill sets that they typically don't get in a classroom environment, but I think most importantly, they themselves are gaining an appreciation for what the real world offers to them when they can teach others. We learn about like the nerves and the muscle tissue and the spinal cord and how your knee reacts when it hits the tendon and the spindle reacts and of the spinal cord. Today I've learned that Every time your brain wants your muscles to move, it sends out electrical impulses that make your muscles do what you want. I can actually remember an experience from being real young, even younger than these guys, and being in elementary school and, and getting to do science fairs and stuff like that. And that's really what drove me to, towards this kind of degree for me and into my future career, hopefully. So I'm, I'm hoping that we can do the same thing for these kids.